I hope you're all having a wonderful day. I'm making some progress on Potion here and I wanted to show you a little bit what I'm doing. Dive in the code a little bit and uh, see how we're gonna move this product forward even more. Um, so I'll, here I am in middleware, underscore middleware.ts. And this is a new thing that uh, Versal added. Next.js version 12 came out, which added a ton of sweet things. And I'm gonna be able to use those for Potion. And this is actually gonna be a pretty big infrastructure change for Potion that I'm making now that Next allows this. Um, but basically, this is actually an edge function, this middleware class. And so it, it runs on the edge, which basically just means that the code can run really close to the user. And so it can make um, some features and things that were possible, that were not possible before, now possible because this can happen so quickly. And so one of the big things that that helps me out with Potion is now I can do some really cool routing um, on the edge layer. So basically what this is doing here is I'm, I'm checking what the domain is and based on the domain, I can then pass that domain value um, to a page in Next. And based on that data, I can then grab the data for a specific Potion website. So it's kind of what's happening right here. I'm passing like the host name, the path name. Now what this allows me to do is really cool. Basically it allows me to have one project, a mono repo, for all the websites that Potion hosts. All the websites will be in one mono repo. Up to this point, you can see here in Versal, I've got a lot of projects. I got a project for every website, which is, which is a lot. Uh, every Potion website. So this is gonna be quite an upgrade. The tricky thing will be how I can slowly kind of merge, or, or not merge, rather migrate to this new kind of mono repo. Um, and to do that, I'll have to have my users actually point to a different server so that they're now pointing to this project, this server that contains the mono repo. And so it'll be kind of a phase release kind of thing. Um, and so that's kind of the plan, and, and that's kind of the challenge that I have next is to figure out the best way to do that so that I can slowly get people moved over. I don't wanna obviously like just pull the rug under for them and say, hey, this server over here doesn't work anymore. I'll, I'll keep the old ones up. Um, but yeah, so this is, this is quite an upgrade, and this will just allow me to move a lot quicker here in the future as I build things on Potion and update the sites way quicker. So I'm really excited about this, and it's gonna be really good. Um, so got some more work to do on it, but I, I've kind of got this upgraded mono repo version kind of done and now it's just kind of testing, making sure it works and then starting the migrating process.